Please, make yourselves comfortable, and I shall let Miss Phillips know that you all have arrived. Thank you. Wow, this, this is nice. I've seen better. I've definitely smelled better. We didn't get to finish eating our lunch. Could we go? Detectives. Please tell me that you're here because you found the son of a gun who did this, and not for my sympathy chocolates in Chateau Latour. Mrs. Phillips? We will definitely pass on the Chateau Latour, but uh, do you mind if I grab a glass of water? Of course, it's just straight back. Leanne will help you if you need anything. Perfect, thank you. Mrs. Phillips, I know this is a difficult time for you, but I have a couple of questions for you, is that okay? Please be brief. I'm grieving. Your husband, Henry Phillips, now, he was your third husband, is that correct? Fourth. And you're a little bit older than him. Slightly. Mrs. Phillips, do you know anyone, anyone that wanted to hurt your husband? What are the detectives doing here? I think they're calling it a homicide. Really? Yeah. Huh. Well, he had the reputation of being a good man in the community, but he was a horrible husband. He used to throw women in front of her. Ugh. Honestly, I bet she's glad she doesn't have to deal with that anymore. <clears throat> she gets to keep the money without all the hassle. Not a bad deal, if you ask me. I'll say cheers to money. And power. Detective, there's something I need to tell you about my husband. He was a very good person. He was a great provider. However, he was extremely mysterious. Mysterious? What do you mean by mysterious, Mrs. Phillips? I'll cut to the chase. I'm sure you've heard the many rumors about his infidelities with the women he employed. How did that make you feel, Mrs. Phillips? Look around. I've grown accustomed to a certain lifestyle. Indiscretions have their privileges. I believe Henry thought I was clueless, but I am no one's fool. When was the last time that you spoke to Mr. Phillips? 6 p.m. He called to tell me that he was working late, as usual. Did he sound unusual at all? No, nothing unusual. Same old Henry. I usually knew what he was going to say before he even said it. Were you aware of any unethical business transactions or dealings that he may have been a part of. Quite honestly, I've never been involved in any of Henry's business affairs. Now, if you will excuse me, I do have a funeral to plan. <laughs> 